Hi Capricorns, welcome back to my channel. We're getting right into your reading today. Let's see how your person is feeling about you at the moment. We have acceptance. Everything has everything is happening for a reason and addiction. Addiction is affecting this relationship. We also have forgiveness, forgiving yourself for another will help you move forward in abundance. You've done the work, abundance flows to you now. So your person's on a good space in their life right now. They're accepting um what has happened and um there are some things that they had to heal. It could be a codependency addictions or addiction, gambling, finances. You know, it could be anything. We also have, you know, your forgiveness. Forgiveness for another will help you move forward. So um, they're stumbling about this because I'm stumbling over my words, Capricorns. They're in their heads about how things didn't work out and how they made the wrong decisions, right? Because they see you flourishing, right? You know, you've done the work. Abundance is flowing. You are getting what you rightfully deserve. You are single. You are beautiful. And you are, are focusing on your coins here. Well, they haven't moved on yet, right? The world, the world card is in reverse. When the world card is upright, this means that a cycle um, has ended and a new one is beginning. The cycle has not closed out yet because there are some unspoken words that they need to say to you, Capricorns, and they're juggling with this again. You know, you felt me stuttering at the beginning of the reading here because they're wondering if they should even come in to contact you because you they feel like you are doing be way better without them, and you are. So it's like, Maybe I should just not say anything and just accept it, right? That everything happens for a reason. I was an idiot. I was an asshole. And I was a fool to make this wrong mistake. But again, spirit is like pushing them to say something here. Right now, they're, you know, they have been watching you. The page of stories is her strength card. I have Leo energy on the board at the moment and cancer. Again, you know, they're watching you have all the success and being your divine feminine energy and they see that you are stronger without them you know i just did leo's reading and it was that regret so if you're dealing with the leo definitely watch that it was a beautiful reading um you know so libra energy they're they're still kind of hesitating you know that's why there's watching here there's they are coming out this fear but it's like they want to apologize but they don't want to sound like manipulative right like I'm only apologizing because I want you back in my life. So it's like, no, I don't want to say that, right? They're literally going back and forth in their head on like every single word on um, how they literally, whatever they say, they don't want to make themselves look like this fool, right? So, you know, um, look like a joke. So it's like, oh, they're going through these different stages of like this regret. Like, why did I even put myself in this position with Capricorn? You know, because you, at one point you were a very bright light in their lives. The sun card is showing up again. Again, Leo and Justice card is showing right up next to each other again. So they're asking for help here. Um, healing that inner child trauma that they had dealt with in regards to growing up, their parenthood, you know. Um, their parents and how they raise them. We have your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So maybe, you know, they lived in a household that wasn't really good at expressing their feelings and it's hard for them to speak up, right? So they're, it's like, they're going to tell you all of this in like one long message, you know? Yeah, I'm going to call you exactly. And I'm wondering who has your attention right now. There's still so many unsaid things between us. So yeah, they're definitely wonder who has your attention. And it's like, I don't know if it's the right time to work on it. And again, the back and forth energy of wanting to work on it, move forward, and then they get spooked and then they come back. But they know that the cycle is thinning, right? It's closing out, right? The five of pentacles is here. Um, they know that only a certain amount of time can pass before, you know, you are completely out there allies forever. So they're angry at this. They're just really in their feelings at the moment. But they're going to walk away from this past feelings and like say something. I'm going to get a card on when. Yeah. After they built some stability, security in their lives. Um, I don't know if it's like financial issues or they're just dealing with something. Yeah, not today. Not dealing, hurt, avoiding a conversation, call, person, boundaries, still angry. Yeah, they don't want you to reject them here like at all. Sorry, these cards are like out of order. So I'm just getting them back in order. <laughs> um... They know you don't, like, want to be bothered by Capricorns. It's like, if they would just reach out, I would really, like, hear them out. You know what I mean? We have the next few months in perfect timing for some of you, yeah. Because it's, it's going to take it's gonna take a while for some of them. We have the world card in reverse. Yeah, they're, look at that. Their guard is still up. And again, just like Leo's reading, wow, I got seven days, seven weeks. The seventh, uh, the seventh date is significant. 
but it's gonna take some time for them to drop their guard i know right and still heal from this yeah but once they do they're gonna come in really fast until then they're just gonna keep watching and waiting on the right time to come to you it's like they're really hoping to see you out in public they are really hoping to just see you out in public so that they can just get it over with they even might try to go to your favorite spots capricorns um so be mindful of this we have the situation will improve improving your health right now and big happy changes are coming your way so yeah continue to focus on yourself and when the opportunity comes you know it's going to be your time to communicate clearly and you know just talk about the truth and what happened in the situation here so it's going to be a good heart to heart we have it's safe for you to love open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all and religious factors your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path i feel like ultimately capricorns you are going to release them here the time has come to clear your energy because big happy changes are coming your way and you're going to move forward you know and that's how do you they feel reading their guard is still up and they just mm -mm, it's just not the right time for them but um i feel like they are making that change to become a stable emotionally mature person which is good so i'm gonna leave it there capricorns have a wonderful week